Right then, let's have a look at these uh, Endura Pro SL bib shorts. World's first bib short with three pad width options. Um, pad width dependent on saddle width. Uh, at the time, I had a, a wide, um, go on, specialised power, whatever, and that was 153 mil. Uh, I've since got rid of that because it just didn't suit me, neither did the narrow version. Uh, and I've got that physique and Tara's Evo um, part of the minute that came with the bike, Celitalia SLR, um, Superflow, really lightweight, it's, it's alright. I think I prefer that one. Anyway, um, bib shorts. These are the bib shorts. Um, according to sizing, I should really have a medium. But when I tried them on, if I remember correctly, uh, the mediums were far, far too tight around my thighs. Um, because they've got really big thighs but um, they seem to fit all right around the waist and what have you so I went with the, went with the large let's have a look so you got the back this is really hard with one hand and a phone pad front size large this is a medium pad. I assume the pads are different colours. Um, but yeah. Um, the pad feels pretty alright, I think. Yeah. Anyway. So there's a couple of reviews online that say that these are um, like some of the most comfortable that you can get. However, um, I don't personally think that takes into account the pad. Um, the pad for me doesn't feel very good in comparison to um, the pad on some bio race types that I've got. That pad, uh, the vapor pad in that seems pretty immense uh, and it's far far more comfortable. Um, so. They are very comfortable, the shorts themselves, and the the really nice ones they're on, even if they are a size too big. Um, but the pad's just not. It's not as good as the pad that you get in a pair of uh, eighty quid by Racer Spitfire shorts. Um, the vapor pad in those is just far better um, but generally comfort wise they're really comfortable other than when you're on on, <laughs> on the bike which sort of defeats the object and I know you're never going to be comfortable comfortable cycling but the the pad doesn't sort of stand up to the rest of the um, the rest of the shorts the elastic bands are pretty wide, uh, they're really nice, they've started sort of like fraying a little bit and bunching up where some of the elastic snapped, um, which is mm, meh, not so good, I well, can see it there, um, but obviously they still work. There's a nice bit, sort of starting from here. That works around the back that's quite supportive it's a different material it hugs nice and tight as i say even though these are a large and effectively a size too big um they still fit really quite quite nice and tight um there's no obviously added on leg grippers like on some other shorts but you know what i mean like an extra panel at the bottom but these are um built in they're really nice really comfortable uh, not 
too tight looks really warm there but actually it's just a bit it's just got a bit shiny where the with the pressure of the pad um kind of shows you where I sit so maybe I'm not making the the most of uh, the pad but yeah I don't know maybe that pad's too wide or not wide enough rather it needs to extend that a little bit but I, I think that's just more uh, uh, a rub on the inside of the saddle down the inside of my thigh a bit rather than actually sitting on it thinking about it um, yeah anyway I think the pad the pads are the same size regardless of what size um, what size you get uh, back bit nice thin mesh really comfortable um, as I say that they are really really comfortable um, other than <laughs> when you're riding in them which kind of defeats the object as I said uh, but yeah really nice shot one thing that is quite annoying is uh, there was an Enduro badge on there and no word of a lie that came off um, after it started peeling after the first ride, second ride um, and then it came off shortly thereafter so that should be that so that came off straight away which is a bit shit but you know other than that, they seem really well made. Um, the pad doesn't seem quite so good. Maybe it's not the right pad for me, uh, size wise. Maybe it's the size of the short that's not quite right for me. Maybe the medium and just dealing with the tightness um, might be a bit better. But who knows? Uh, I think they're like 120 quid. Wouldn't pay that again I'd rather just go with uh, as I say some of the yeah, cheaper bio racer spitfire shorts um, yeah some of those for 80 quid 70 odd quid whatever they are uh, yeah I'll have a look at these in another video I think Pretty cool. Thank you. See you later.